I'll do it. Hello everyone, my name is Mitchell and welcome back to Baldur's Gate. So we are gonna continue to the friendly army and get some quests done. Cleaning up some inventory space and <laughs> and then getting rid of some stuff while uh, hopefully getting some money and why not experience. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought that guy was coming for us. Might as well activate the easy mode. So I don't have to worry about who these guys are. To gather your party before venturing forth. I've done had enough of this. So Drone is still waiting for us here. Kinda. Come on, just climb the damn thing. <laughs> Guys, you don't have to fight already. Right, just go up. Go Ryan would be proud of your actions. Really? Okay, guys, what the hell is going on? My turn to save the day. How may I be of assistance? I shall attend to it in a trice. Stand back and watch this. It shall be as you wish. What? I can't enter the upstairs. This way. What the hell is going on? Okay, it was just a. I've done had enough of this. Probably some kind of interface bug. I don't know. I'm gone. That was that was so weird. Ah, uh, I'm so glad that I can move home again. So I brought him uh, the boots, the spider, and the uh, bottle of wine. So that was nice. Now, uh, is the pantalones guy still here? Oh, we don't want to talk to him. He might get a little bit uh, cranky since we <laughs> stole his. Golden Bandalones. You cannot get better than the stability stone walls provide. 95 gold pieces for your trouble and a new history book I've just completed. What? Uh, history of Thatcher. I don't think I've gotten that before, so interesting. Yeah, I'm not gonna go through all that. I, I've uh, read all the books at least uh, twice. Ever since the game was immediately re released and uh, I know I don't remember any of that stuff anymore. But uh, I'm not gonna go through it, uh, through it again. Plus I don't really have a voice for reading too many books. Uh, yeah, I guess I will sell, sell some stuff. We don't actually have anyone who can throw darts, but uh, I still feel hesitant uh, to just uh, get rid of them. All oh, right, we need to find Miriam in 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 Embergos as well, and Perdu. I cleaned up my inventory a little bit, put uh, stuff in the bag of holding. I guess we could check. So yeah, the wyvern head is there. I still can't sell it. I don't remember where we got the ornate key or where it would be used. Do you want to tell me a story about trollops and plug tails? It was probably Mulahe. But uh, that key must have had something to do with the, the bandit camp. I don't know. This way. We are not, not yet uh, in that part of the game, so. I think that's enough of friendly arm in for now. We are just immediately gonna leave. And go back to Berghost to complete some uh, quests again. Rashad is so fast.
Okay, and yeah, very ghost. Here we go. I've done had enough of this. Okay. First of uh, Lady Miriam, I think she lives. Uh, I think it was the eastmost building of uh, Berghost. If uh, that's a word or anything. And I seem to remember that the entrance was kind of weird. Yeah, it's, uh, it's this house, okay. I think it's this house. Anyway. And uh, sure, there she is. Salutations. My husband had, made, uh, had to make a sudden business trip to Amn and I'm so worried for him. Uh, Miriane, he always said. Miriane, who knows, the road is better than old row. But the high was just not safe and stuff like that. Oh, she's actually asking that could we keep her eyes open. Yep. We gave the letter to her. Uh, the road has been difficult, but I have arrived safely here in Amn. And yada yada. Please let me give you this ring to keep you safe in your travels. Oh. So. Yeah, the original messenger, of course, died during the trip. So it's yet another plus one ring. I think I'll put that on Nera, actually. I'm just checking our armor class. Huh? Guys, could uh, everyone could actually use the ring. But I feel like the worst uh, armored guys are the priority right now. This way. Let's go check their upstairs. I've huh? done had enough of this. I'm gone. Because you know, Imoen is a kind of thief, so she she's curious. I don't know if I want to collect all the books. Okay. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's not stealing if it's uh, if it's an accident, right? We are just accidentally going through all the items and taking whatever. Seems like they are quite poor, so we are gonna leave. I've Goodbye. done had enough of this. I'm gone. Let's see what's in this barrel. I don't know if I actually ever have gone through all the buildings. Uh, some of these places just get you in a trouble, so I don't know if I want to do them. Uh, one thing I should do is uh, visit Kagain's shop. <laughs> That's a <laughs> interesting description. Host of Alanna's neighbor, but uh, I mean, you could also say that. Uh, <clears throat> That neighbor's name there, right? So I think we have uh, these boots, worn worshippers, whispers, worn whispers, uh, for the guy in uh, in that place. Uh, now these are very good uh, boots for thieves, but since we are not doing any backstabbing stuff, uh, I'm purely skilling Imoin up for for for. Lock picking uh, or uh, unlocking things and, and disarming traps and finding traps. So I don't care about this that much. So I'm gonna give these boots away. If I remember correctly, the reward wasn't exactly fantastic. So, so, so. I think it was too long. Back home, Puff Guts would always tell me a story. Let's actually make sure because he will steal money from us if. Uh, If uh, <laughs> if if uh, we talk to him every time we talk to him, I think he steals part of our money. Mm. Okay, this seems to work well. So Perdo was the short sword guy. Right, we returned all the laundry's possessions. That quest is just broken now. Okay. Maybe we haven't talked to him actually. Who's Penny? 
Hello there. Can the woman get a bit of bees around here? Uh, wanna hit on her? You look like you might have an ear to the ground. Uh, what's going on? I've seen some pretty strange things lately. The iron is crumbling, work is scarce, what trade there is for my profession is hardly worth the effort, and people are going missing, and mines are in the mines or out of them. Mind your way tonight. The girls are not safe as they were. Okay. Let's see how much he was, uh, he's gonna steal. <laughs> so we didn't apparently talk to him at all. Uh, what is it easy to do, huh? You invest in some boots of stealth, uh, you set up uh, set up shop in the Badlands, to the south of Burghast, and then wham! Along comes a tribe of hobgoblins and they tear with the boots right off your feet. Ten blasted bullies is what they are, and I'll pay 100 gold to whoever can uh, get them back to me. I will... Oh, look, it's Trista Urdan. And uh, he stole 15 gold from us. You're a godsend. Oh, here's all the gold I took from you. I'm, I might be kleptomaniac. But at least I'm an honorable one, right? And here's one of the gold pieces for your help too. Consider it a down payment on your pocket. Whew, so much ado about some stupid boots. And you know what? Mineral in those boots, he'd only become better at stealing. So let's keep our eyes on our money while we are around here. Who? Me? What do you want to do when you grow up, Iman? This is a different discussion, I suppose. Uh, well, I was thinking of studying magic. Hey, how come you never ask Mutral that? I'm not much younger than he is. I hope that Mutral will have much choice in what he wants to do in Fudre. No, do not ask me why, but you're right. If I don't uh, think him as a child, then I'll try not to think uh, the same of you. Providing, of course, that your behavior matches the desired maturity. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Ha! Look at Miss Vanapi Pat, the leader who sulks if she has to stay in the back talking maturity giggles. And I bet uh, you'd have same some advice ready for me that very minute on acting grown up, wouldn't you, Auntie Jahira? <laughs> not asking everyone for stories about trolls and heroes would be a start. But but they're the best kind of stories, see? It's just that uh, you haven't heard any good ones. Let me tell you tell you about the one Boofkut told me. It happens to be the of trolls. That's enough, child. Sheesh, you're not my mother and never will, will be, Jahira. Hey, I just got a swell idea. Maybe if Khalid and you have a kid, you will have less of your um, maternal frustrations. Hmm, <clears throat> that's... Um, probably something you should <laughs> shouldn't just... Uh, point out. Uh, perhaps my aggravation indeed rose in not having a child of my own. Hmm. Definitely something to ponder upon. Yeah. So... What happened with the boots? We lost the boots, uh, we got experience, we get got gold. So, yeah. He would say it was worth it. Rashant get a level up. Unfortunately, he's a monk, so he doesn't really benefit that much from any of that. And only weapon tiles she, he can actually learn is the single weapon. So we are gonna go with that. Uh, most of the time I feel like, uh, or I know he will be f without any weapon at all. So. so so I don't think the provisions really matter. Let's try the hiding shadows for him. Could be interesting. Hmm... So he's uh, now level 4. That means that uh, the Sun Sol Ray now does uh, 2d8 dam fire damage. Uh, so that's uh, 2 to 16, I believe. Which is, again, a huge variance. This way. You want some whiskey? So this guy only sells rooms. I've done had enough of this. And uh, let's actually I'm talk. Gone. Eh, what leave me to the fire run with you? And uh, I hope you get the gout. Fire wine. What's and where is that? Fire wine bridge ruin, uh, ruins is what I mean. She's pre she be pretty far, pretty far to the south and east. Ah, oh, they are, they are. Yeah. There was a. Uh, the Farmine Bridge is an interesting place, and we will definitely go there, but it's uh, not yet, let's let's put it that way. 
It's a quite dangerous place. And Imoin is gonna loan some stuff from these poor people. Ooh. What's this then? Okay. I wonder if I can... Nope. Oh, it's the stupefier. It uh, has a 10% chance to per hit of stunning target for one round save versus spell negates. So they actually nerfed this weapon because uh, it, user, it was something like 25% chance. And there was no save, so it was a stupidly good stupefier. Now it's just only decent. I think I have actually used all my, yeah, all my spells, so. And I don't think anyone of our group will right now uses mazes, so I'm just gonna put it in there. Well, uh, Truco is back of holding, so it doesn't actually wait anything. I've Those bags of holdings of didn't exist in the original game, and uh, it's a, it feels a little bit cheating because that helps uh, out with the inventory management so much. This way. Hmm. So Perdu was in a, in a red chief, I believe. Let's actually save before we do something stupid. Like fight Silke again. Oh, come on, guys, you can. Yeah, this is actually a weird bug. It, uh, it used to happen a lot more in the original game. Uh, where is one of our guys? <laughs> okay, this is why. Uh, yeah, this is also very annoying. Uh, sometimes people just uh, get stuck to each other. And for whatever reason, the AI isn't willing to unstuck itself. I've done had enough of this. But yeah, that's why we couldn't get through the door. So, Perdu is I'm right gone. there. Hmm, figured maybe he'd eaten it by now. I hope you ran. I'm true once or twice to get it at least. Oh, ran him true once or twice uh, to get it at least. Now take your 50 gold and be gone. So we got a, quite a bit of uh, experience for that. I think it was worth it. You Only 50 gold. Risky. But you know, gold isn't everything. Tulborg is still here. Let's uh, see if we can get something new out of him. Hmm. What can you offer me? Ah, not much. Oh! I'm nearly sold out. I will go to some other places. It has become a bit uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. You know the word. I'm not gonna try to pronounce it anymore uh, here lately. No one is willing to buy me drinks anymore. Dang! And now this bottle has leaky cock. Give me an empty bottle and you can have it this portion for free. What a coincidence? I have an empty bottle right here. That comes in handy indeed. Let me take out the fluid in the unbroken bottle. Here you go. It's a standard healing portion. I have to sell those too. Otherwise the customers wouldn't be satisfied. But that was it then. I guess and I'm on the way. I was wondering what I would do with the... With the empty bottle. So I guess it really is just a standard healing potion. It's probably this. I'm fine with that. That's uh, good enough for me. Let's actually put these games in the game back. We have a couple potions. Invisibility. So this is actually interesting. It is very long. 
very long duration, but it doesn't uh, work in combat, so... That's interesting. Free action is nice. Yeah, it gives you a free movement. I might need that somewhere sometime later, so I'm gonna keep it at hand. I'm just looking through all the pot uh, potions we have uh, gathered so far. This is very good fighting potion. So is a uh, magic immunity actually. I don't know. It's one of those things, uh, you have even more potions in the visibility. It's one of those things, uh, I tend to never actually use the potions. You're waiting for a hard fight to use them so you don't waste them, but uh, usually those fights never happen. So this is the electric resistance plus 100 potion. Uh, let's give them the... And let's give the stone form as well to Rashad. Because he dies a lot, so maybe I can use those to save him. Back home, Puff Guts would always tell me a story. This way. Hi, Lanovel. My traveler Aurelio is the name Aurelio Winspear. Have you seen... Uh, haven't seen you around here. So... Yeah, there's, uh, he's just telling us some basic information about Burgos. I'll do it. Oh, you. Yeah, that's a that's a wrong purple girl. I've done had enough of this. Yep, they <laughs> definitely haven't been here before. Oh, a leather armor, really? Or maybe I have been. Hmm. I guess I couldn't unlock that I'm one gone. door. I'm just uh. This way. Yeah, I think I actually looted that place before. Okay. I've done had enough of this. And what day is it? It's day 18, so I don't think the armor is ready yet. Uh, hmm. Day 16 or hour 18 is when we left the armor, so I think it might be ready tomorrow. I am gone. Or day after that. Uh, let's visit again. Again, Kagen is a joinable NPC, but he might have some other quests. I don't remember quite. Uh, he's an evil character, so I'm not gonna travel with him. Greetings. I am Kagen. Oh, Kagen. My bad. What kind of shop is this, anyhow? So he runs escort business, um, hiring mercenaries to protect the caravans and so on. Tell us more. So normal, I wouldn't give them one damn. Uh, but one of the passengers was son of the Android suicide. Uh, hmm. Wait, didn't. Uh, well, there sure is trouble on the road, so I haven't seen them so myself. I don't remember if we got the Enter Silver Shield thing this playthrough yet. Uh, some. We did see a slain caravan up north and fought off the bandits, but uh, we were too late. Is this from one of yours? Yeah. Well, this is a Silver Shield Sons marker. Did you say? That was one of my caravans. Guess I'm in a lot of trouble now. With him dead, I'll be one the twelve. Well, since my reputation is now mud. How about I help you gain uh, revenge on those scumbags? Perhaps you can put a, in a word for me with the silver shells. What do I say? Uh, we don't want you around, so hit the road. Um, yeah. 
your loss here. Indeed, he's a very good uh, character. But uh, I will uh, not use the evil guys because uh, they can get a little bit tricky. Mostly that some of uh, the good guys actually want to fight them. Or vice versa, they will attack some of the good guys in our squad. Which in a very bad position places uh, can actually be very deadly. The whole squad. Plus now we can loot all of his things. <laughs> Since he just run away. Okay. Not request done. I've done had enough of this. What else is there? I think we finally got everything. Detain it or Quest lock is pretty useless, I, <laughs> I have to say. Oh, that was actually journal. Um, well, that that explains a lot. A lot. <clears throat> so Kakan actually gave us a uh, quest. Oh, I have to still deliver the pin to the family. Okay. It's just a way of a uh, flaming feast, right? We do have the nearest quest to go to Adoi. Also, I think Nero wants a flute. Okay. Well, that's uh, interesting, I would say. So, what will we do actually do next? Guess I could for the Adois Enclave see with the see about the Nera's quest. Uh, that's uh, going to be a blind quest for me. I haven't done it before, so I don't actually know how hard it will be or what is even involved. So it might be stupid, but let's uh, let's see. It's 32 hours of travel, so. You have been waylaid by enemies and must defend yourself. Yeah, I must probably defend myself multiple times. Oh, I thought That's a lot of Gibralings. At least our guys are dealing with them quite efficiently. I'm gone. What is it this time? Another identifier spell. Let's put it there. It is here. Save yep. and we are continuing. Do you want to tell me a story about trollops and plug tails? Please. So we made about 10 hours before getting interrupted. You have been by enemies yep. and must defend yourself. Long travels uh, cause all kind of. Weird issues. Oh, I thought I'd not in this. This way. No. Continue attacking. I wanna heal myself. Yes. Do have the faster heals here, so. Okay. I will show you justice. That should be enough. I've done had enough of this. These guys are really not that tough anymore. Guess I will pick up uh, pick up all the arrows and things. Well, most of them anyway. I'm gone. So let's heal up. You want this way. I guess I cannot save here. I'm gonna 
Hopefully we get the rest before our stuff goes down here. It looks like... a uh, squirrel! Car! Car! Oh, oh, somebody turned into a squirrel. Uh, what? Uh, um, alright. Am I dreaming or did that squirrel just cast us? I think that means we're getting close. Unless that squirrel had a crow for a father, I'd say it was recently polymorphed. <laughs> Okay. Do you really think a mage who turns birds into squirrels can help you? That all depends on whether he meant to turn the crow into a squirrel. Yeah, I guess that's true. Let's uh, rest. I've done had enough of this. So it's uh. Pretty straightforward road. Uh, goblins. King Rockdock. Tell King Rockdock Peepers is coming to get Bob Pivak. Got to protect Bob Pivak. Okay. I don't think I've seen goblins in uh, the game before. Uh, wait a second. Who is this? Uh, uh, who is this Bargrivyuk? Bobriviak is goblin god of setting territory and care upper cooperation. Cooperation? That be it. Territory and cooperation. Bobriviak be god of that stuff. Sure. In that case, we should. Uh, um, we don't care about the territory, though. <laughs> uh. In that case, we should probably go see ba Bar Grievig. Uh, we come to talk about co cooperation and uh, territory and stuff. Nobody gets to see Bar Grievig uh -huh. anymore. King Rogdop keep him safe from outsiders. So, uh, not a middleman. I hate middleman. Die middleman. Uh, okay, well. I guess Bob violence solves all the problems. Possibly frosty. That was a little bit sudden. What? They are fighting so much about the cooperation. Well, the good news is they seem to be just as weak as every sword and other guy. Oh shit. Hunter here. Somebody broke the sword here. Seems I'm like done. the fight is still going on somewhere. Oh, Magreb, who the hell are you? Don't mess with nature, or it'll mess with you. <laughs> okay. Uh, look out, they're coming through the trees. They're behind that rock. No, wait, that was just a shadow of a cloud. You have to be on your guard. They come out of nowhere, but uh, now they are everywhere. Uh, uh, <laughs> if I don't want crazy, I'll talk with Nero. Yeah, uh, calm yourself, man. Take a deep breath and tell us what you've seen. Goblins. They fell out of the sky and or leaped up a full grown, uh, leap up full grown out of the grass. I don't know. All I know is they killed Rilsa when she tried to talk to them, and I can't face them by myself. Okay. Slow down. You're obviously been through a lot, but you're safe now. Tell me what happened. Uh, forgive me, my name is Magreb. Rilsa and I have watched over this area for years, and we never had any trouble with goblins before. Since they killed her, I've been half out of my mind with grief. I can understand your pain, Magreb. It's hard to lose a loved one. Just a few months ago, poof, goblins as far as the eye can see. 
At first they appeared out of uh, around the house of an old mage, but soon they moved into a set of caves to the northeast, taking him with them. Not long after that, a big hobgoblin arrived and made himself king of the tribe. Yeah, I guess. Hmm, what do you know of this old maid? The maid's name was Adoe. He always kept his distance, he said, because he didn't uh, want to hurt us with his magic. I thought it was some kind of threat, but Rilsa said uh, he was just peculiar. Adoe, that's who we're looking for, isn't it? Wait a I second, mean, Magreb. What do you mean by was? You should know who we are looking for, right? I suppose he could still be alive, but I haven't seen Adoe since the goblins carried him into their cave. I just assumed they slain him since they also killed uh, Rilsa. Okay, what else can you tell me about this hobgoblin? The goblins called their new king uh, Rogdog. Apparently he set, up, uh, set himself up as a high priest to one of their gods. Hmm, that's weird. Rogdog. Godrog. When the goblins sprang up of their rocks, look out, there's one at your feet. Okay, don't worry, it's just a rock, what else can you tell me about this old mage? The mage's name was Adoi, he always kept his distance, he said, because he didn't want to hurt us with his magic. I thought it was one, uh, was some kind of threat, but Rilsa said he was just peculiar. Adoi, okay. that's who we're looking for, isn't it? I'll deal with these goblins. Wait a second, Magreb. What do you mean by was? Yeah, they've taken over a series of caves to the northeast. Be careful if you go there. They sent out so many battles that I've been afraid to go near enough to recover Rilsa's body. Poor Rilsa, she only wanted to talk with them. Okay, don't worry, I'll get the bottom of all this. So, apparently the... Goblins are quite hostile. Let's see. Direwolf, huh? I will show you justice. How oh, is uh, Rosat already wounded? <laughs> Okay, there's a bridge here. I guess you can't get anywhere there. Didn't he say northeast? I could swear that it was northeast. This is uh, kind of southeast, if anything. More goblins. Yay! come out of this uh, building here or what? Or maybe they are in the rocks. Are they actually invisible? I've done had enough. I could really use yep. tensors floating they damage are. over here. They are invisible. My turn oh to save my the day. God. By your command. For the fallen! Cross the damn shield. Oh, God damn it. So this is gonna be very, 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 very annoying. This. I'm gone. Because uh, invisible guys uh, tend to go for the mages. Oh shit! I'm picking up. 
a lot of junk there. Okay. That should be enough arrows for now. And since these are near us, uh, story mission, I think I should go with Do you want to tell me a story about trollops and blood tails? Please? Yeah, this is gonna be a long one, I feel like. Invisible goblins, that's just the thing we need. Well, the good thing is we can actually go to the, all the way to Beragost and grab our new armor. Yeah, I definitely should remember to cast the armor spell, especially on Nira, this right way. away. When we come into a new region. Okay. Yeah, it's... Almost the same travel to go all the way back to Beregos anyway. I've done had enough of this. It's a weird looking temple now that <laughs> now that I'm zoom zoomed out. I'm gone. Okay, let's get her back. 400. Oh, shit. This is gonna be expensive trip. Let's give her stuff back. I should probably remember to buy some bullets. What belt was it? Oh, it's a double the fire base damage. Yeah, I don't think I will use that. Oh, we have a, we have plenty of bullets. This way. Okay. I've done had enough of this. Now I'm gonna visit Beragos and uh, get that armor and that's probably enough for this episode and then we will uh, head back. I'm I don't done. know, invisible guys are always so freaking annoying and we don't have any detect invisibility thing. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than nice. the competition. So that will go for Auntie Chahira. I'm actually gonna sell that. Yeah, let's sell the dagger. Uh, sell the plate mail. Do I wanna sell the chain mail plus one? I guess. It's, uh, it's not really that good. I'm uh, still gonna hand on to the shield. It might uh, come useful. Sure, let's sell all this junk. Okay. Let's head back. Those Ankex sell uh, armors are very, very good. Mm. Yeah. You have been waylaid by enemies. I will show you I'm gone. Uh, possibly frosty. Uh, Death. So there's a lot of a lot of them. Come on. What is it that I shall attend to it in a yeah, literally <laughs> Do you wanna tell me six guys hitting him, one one of dude and he's still managed to get a hit. Okay. 
Okay. That is down. I've done had enough of this. I'm actually gonna rest right now. I've been thinking about you. Okay. Good thoughts, I hope. Not bad ones anyway. Mostly I can't figure you out. For example, why did you help me escape the Red Wizards? I mean it seemed like the right thing to do, you needed help. That sounds very noble, but is it the real reason? Uh I mean Honestly, I stepped in because you needed help and I could give it. As simple as that, is it? Hmm. I thought there might be more to you than meets the eye. <laughs> With me, what you see is what you get. Uh, yeah. Really? Well, that's a shame. If it's true. Okay. I think she likes me. Fine. So, that's a good way, a good place to end this episode, and uh, see you guys on the next one. See you there. Bye. You little monkey spiker.